What's up, YouTubers? Uh, so this is Oscar um, from Garcia's Lawn Service making my 2019 uh, lawn care setup. And I did one a couple a month ago, but it was it was a terrible because I mean it was it's spring supposedly, but it was still cold. So I'm making a really good video. Uh, hopefully. You guys can appreciate it a little better. I, I didn't like the other one, so let's start uh, with uh, my mowers. Uh, this is so a, this is the one from last year. Um, <clears throat> this uh, this is a 2004, uh, 48 inch uh, with the Kohler um, and the X Mart uh, with the Kohler engine. It's a 20. Yeah, 20 horsepower, and it has the bagger on. It's been working very awesome for me. I cannot complain. Um, I haven't uh, done anything to it uh, other than just uh, regular tune-ups. Um, I have done two so far, uh, and bought the new spindles on the bottom just because it was, you know, it was old. And when I got it, I got it last year before uh, winter time. I mean, I made a video out of it. And I don't know, I just wanted to start with new spindles. I didn't want to uh, be in the hustle of, you know, spindle breaking or a bearing going off bad. So that's the only thing so far. I like it because you can do your maintenance even for the hydro gears. Um, it was very easy to do it. Easier than the other one over there. Uh, actually, they're both the same. Uh, actually, the third one that I have on my shed is the one that is a little more pain in the butt to do on the hydro gear fluid change and filter change but anyway this one has been working has been it's already it's been paid off a long time ago already i've been doing uh projects with it with it and so far i you know it's it's an old one it's a 2004 but i loved it uh i've been loving it i've been having a really good time with it um uh so yeah and then uh this year i'm gonna start with this one and I think I'm just going to start with this too. Um, the other one that I have on the shed, um, I can show you guys later or, you know, in my other videos. I, I'll eventually, uh, eventually I'll start using that. Uh, but for right now, I'm going to use this too. Uh, this mower is a 2014 um, with a 27 horsepower Kohler engine. It's a commercial grade. And it's a fuel injected. That's what I like about it. There's no choke on it. And you can tell right here, apparently. I just learned that this year when I got this one. Um, so I guess that's one of the benefits about fuel injected. Um, that you don't need to choke it or anything. Um, the only thing I did to this one, it was a fresh tune-up uh, for the engine. I haven't done anything for the hydro gear. I haven't changed that out. But this pretty much basically right here. Everything's right here. So that's what I like about this. And then uh, I did I bought new uh, new tires. Um, and as you can see, I bought the new um, the plastic, the black plastic that goes around. And then just to make it more uh, presentable for customers. And then the new belt, the driver belt. Um, uh, I checked the blades. Blades were balanced and sharpened them. I really like this one, um, but I'll be starting using it tomorrow, and I'll probably make a video about it um, for a review. But for the most part, uh, you know, so far so good. Uh, again, I'm, I'm gonna keep working on this. This I bought them new since I started my business, so I think this is like the fourth year for it. Um, you got the the Husqvarna's. Uh, I bought both of them in low at Lowe's. This one is the Husqvarna 150 uh, BT. Great, great power. Enough power for me. I've been so happy with it. Um, I haven't done anything but just change the the little filter, air filter. Uh, same thing with this one. Uh, this <clears throat> the string broke on me, so I end up buying this piece right here. I'm oh, sorry. This piece right here, it came with uh, the whole plastic and the spring inside. So it was very easy to replace three bolts 
boom boom it was easy other than that i haven't done anything to it which this year hopefully i get to buy new equipment i'm hoping for that right now i was focused more on the mowers uh because this this tool this tool uh the blower and the trimmer has been working great uh for what i've been doing and then i got the attachments which i totally recommend guys you know i bought them on lowe's they were not that much under a hundred dollars each uh, but they are worth it the edging uh which this one right here the Husqvarna it's 128 L LD or C something like that I'll double check on that look into my other videos it's 128 LD I think that's what it is um, but it's the one that you can put attachment into it so I bought the edger and then I bought the trimmer which seriously guys I made a lot of money just with this thing and I haven't done any type of maintenance other than lubricating it um, I bought this one this year the extender just in case I need to use it to extend which the weight is not too too bad uh, I think this is 10 pounds uh, so it's pretty not heavy enough and I got the normal uh, trimming um, which I did had to replace this part right here eventually because it broke um, and I bought this right here at Lowe's uh, for like less than 20 bucks and it's been going uh, helping me uh, it's been pretty great I mean I can't complain um, and <coughs> excuse me the blower has been working awesome my trailer same one since I started my business is a 7 by 12 um, uh, last year I broke this I just put that tip on there um, but it still works I'm not worry about it and then this year um, what I did is I bought this springs uh, they're like for a garage door and I bought them for I think they were less than yeah about about $30 I think and I kind of did a modification it was under I think uh, under you know uh, $40 um, and they work great um, I'm very happy about those um, it's very easy to pick up really easy to let it down <laughs> uh, seriously one hand and I still do it I did it like this not to not the greatest but I just wanted to make it a demo first and see how well it does um, as you can see I already lost a little screw on this one but this one holds it and apparently it's not look at that guys I will not have to deal with that anymore so I'm very happy under $40 I was able to just do it this way nothing big <coughs> nothing huge uh, worst case scenario I was gonna put it on the connected here with the little hole on it and some extra extenders nah, but I was, that ended up working perfect for me on my trailer so uh, this is what I'm gonna be using still for a year. I did bought new tires. They used to, my dad bought had him in his backyard. That's why they're all like rusted out. But they're brand new uh, tires. He just never used them. So I bought both tires from him. Uh, Fifty bucks. <coughs> Excuse me. Fifty bucks. Uh, so if you guys know about how how much they are going for I got a really good deal out of them um, same thing same truck 2004 um, it has a hundred and hundred and one thousand miles on it with the Hemi on uh, I use it for plowing uh, which was only about what uh, four snowfalls that we had this 2018 2019 winter um, uh, again guys I got my normal equipment uh, on the toolbox just the cutters and you know some other stuff in there <clears throat> and better video I know uh, uh, I know it's possible to do it if you guys are thinking about starting your own business uh, thankfully right here this equipment and well the equipment 
if you go into my videos the equipment that I had before but pretty much my business since I started I don't I think it was 2015 or 16 when I started um, I was able to buy this house humbly enough it's not a newest house but humbly you know uh, this business my business I've been taking care of it humbly you know with my customers customers I'm sorry and it does pay you pay you back so I'm looking forward for the best this year and yeah guys if you guys uh, like this video please like it subscribe um, and if you guys have any comments please leave them below, uh, on the bottom and uh, we'll start this year you and I youtuber awesome we we'll start business don't 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 give up keep going uh, if, especially if this is your first year don't hesitate it's awesome it's a good deal buy a used mower and something cheap you know start with something small and eventually little by little you get better and better your business pays off all the time just be patient and always humble all right guys let's keep mowing